Before we get started, let's cover some of the basic graphic design concepts that you need to know in order to feel comfortable with our course. Vector serves for editing vector graphics. So what is the difference between vector graphics and raster graphics? Vector graphics are constructed with paths or lines, and each vector graphics file has all of the information about the color, size, and the direction of those lines. On the other hand, raster graphics are just the arrays of pixels. The practical difference is that vector graphics are scalable, which means that when you enlarge them, they still remain clear and crisp, whereas raster graphics become blurry and pixelized. Let's see the example of how it looks like on other photos. The vector graphics piece on the right doesn't look like a real photo because it is constructed with paths or lines, whereas on the left there is an image constructed with raster graphics. The practical difference, however, when creating those art or graphic design pieces is that when drawing with vectors and when magnified, the pieces remain the same, crisp and clean, and you can always magnify them and modify them, and they'll be fine. Whereas when painting with pixels, they get really blurry and really not clear when magnified. So always remember about that. And that explains why Vector is actually used for creating logotypes and mockups and booklets and brochures because those pieces you actually want and need to magnify and to modify in different kinds of ways and you really need the Vector graphics to be clear, crisp and clean.